Hey guys, you're here with Denitra, and this is my first Digital Delights tutorial. And um, today I'm going to show you guys how you can use your um, sentiments from Digital Delights to create your own background or pattern paper. Um, very fun, easy to do, and extra versatile. So um, right now I've got Word open because I'm sure everyone has Word and it's very familiar to a lot of people. And so um, I'm just going to create some digital... Um, background paper for you. So um, right now you're going to open up your Word and you're going to go to insert and picture and I'm going to go to my files and this is where I have all of my digital downloads and as you can see I've got the um, summer surfing fun um, sentiments from Digital Delights and um, on my sample card that I made a couple weeks ago I did the So Amped and um, I think I'm going to use the Surf Up today. So you're just going to pick a sentiment and um, you insert it into your file and right now this is pretty big so I'm going to left click on it and I'm going to lay out in, in a square so it's easier to um, make smaller or bigger and I'm just going to shrink it down okay and um, I'm going to actually create this over onto the whole um, sheet um, so let me make this a little bit bigger Okay, and now you just simply copy and paste. Okay, and then you're going to move them in a line. Okay, just kind of set them up. So here's our, and I know it looks a little sketchy. I moved it all the way to this side so it'll be easier for me to cut this off and cut the top and the bottom off. It's easier to, um, will be to um, cut it down to size for my card. And I'm going to print this on glossy cardstock. Okay, so we've printed out our um, pattern paper. And um, as you can see, I've cut it down to size to fit on an A2 size card. And I've already started coloring a little bit. Okay. I printed it up on um, glossy cardstock just because I like the way it looks. Um, you could print it off on... Um, any cardstock that you would like. So I've got some brush tip markers here, or brush pens, and I'm just um, coloring in the words, um, the letters. So um, I'm not going to have you watch me do all of this. I'm going to edit some of it out, but I just wanted to let you see um, that you could mix and match your colors if you wanted. I'm just using some tropical summery colors. Okay. Okay, and I'm going to finish coloring this up and we'll come back and um, assemble it. Okay, so all of our coloring is done and now we're going to mount this onto our card base. Okay. And I've got a piece of orange cardstock and I've um, border punched it with this um, scallop border punch from EK Success in um, his short in orange and his little surf surfboard in orange and yellow. And my idea I was going to put this. Okay, so it's very fun colors. Let's find our adhesive. Okay, and then Pippin is on Surfing Pippin is on dimensionals. Those little arms up, okay. So it's very glossy in the back, and then you've got Pippin there, and then I've got um, this extra little 
one here that I'm going to put on this um, chipboard piece. got our um, card finished and um, I've switched out the other chipboard piece it didn't really it wasn't really orange enough and um, so here's Pippin looking so fun he's really cute you guys um, and then here is another one that I made earlier this week and I used the so amped and colored it in with distress inks um, with and uh, aqua brush so I hope you guys like um, this idea of creating your own um, backdrop and um, hope this inspires you. I will see you guys um, in a couple of weeks for another tutorial. Have a wonderful Tuesday. Bye.